All right, what's good YouTube? Your boy Eric here, back with another quick video on Grubhub. So this past weekend I picked up the 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Uh, shift for Saturday. And for the past maybe about four weeks I've been trying to get that, that's, that schedule for either a Saturday or a Sunday. Uh, reason being is that usually at that point, you're not getting, at that time on the weekend, you're not getting a lot of deliveries. So it's easy just to go out, maybe do one delivery, get the hourly guarantee because you're at 100% and you call it a day. Um, so this week, um, pretty much did the same thing. The order, first order came in at around 11.55. When, went and got that delivery out the way. It was a decent sized one. So it was like a $9 and change uh, order. So I was like, perfect. Second order comes in and it's 30, it's 30 minutes away, like literally 30 minutes away. And I'm like, yo, why would they send me an order, another request for, for pickup for some place that's 30 minutes away? So I had some business to do in that area anyway. So I was just like, you know what? I'm going to do it. So I went and did that order. Um, I, or, or at least I, I attempted to do that order. I got to the restaurant. They go, um, they go, you know, you were too slow. They canceled. So I was like, whatever. It's a little ghetto KFC. So I wasn't even, I wasn't worried about it. So I was like, whatever. It was a $3 order too. So then I started thinking to myself, all right, if I pick, if I made one order, I missed this order, then there's no way I'm going to make the hourly guarantee. So I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna go about handling my business, what I do what I gotta do, and pretty much just call it a day. And that's what I did. Another order didn't come in until maybe about an hour after that for the same restaurant, another three dollar order. And I was like, you know what? Reject. Because again, for me to go out my way for three dollars, knowing knowing ahead of time that I'm not gonna make at least the hourly guarantee didn't make sense for me so so that was pretty much my my day another order came in like right as I'm about to end so I just switched off I was like forget it I'm yeah I'm not gonna do that order um, but yeah man that yeah that's the main thing with this Grubhub thing you have to kind of balance what makes sense for you so it, to me it didn't make sense for me to drive it wouldn't have made sense for me to drive 30 minutes to do this order unless I had business in that area, right? And if I had just rejected that order, then I would have been at like 50%. So there's no way I would have gotten any hourly guarantee. So even if I had rejected the offer, didn't do the 30 minute drive, I would have most likely just called it, a, called it a day at that point because if I'm not, unless there's all the big orders coming in, I'm not gonna make the minimum, the hourly guarantee, and I'm not gonna really make any money. So, you know, just wanted to give you guys that quick tip. Thanks for checking out the video and uh, enjoy the rest of your day.